For April 21st, we have a lifestyle of believing God makes you bolder in your love for others and in what you can believe for in their lives. Well, you can believe whatever you want, but, you know, it's not going to make it happen. Your word asks me why I judge or look down on my brother. Well, probably because I'm an asshole. I acknowledge to you today, Lord, that we will all stand before your judgment seat. Sure we will. Because we'll be on our spiritual asses. Or, well, we'll, we'll be on our spiritual feet while God's on his magical spiritual ass. And not a donkey. It is written, as surely as I live, says the Lord in English, every knee will bow before me, every spiritual knee. Every tongue will confess to God every ethereal flapping tongue. So then, each of us will give an account of himself to God. So the proof that God gives us that we will be judged by him is that he lives. And since there's no evidence that he exists, therefore this is meaningless and this is a totally empty... This is not an affirmation of anything. Therefore, help me to stop passing judgment on others. For that reason? No, 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 no. no. Just because it's bad to judge others, not because... God, or some invisible being in the sky. Instead, I make up my mind not to put any stumbling block or obstacle in my brother's way. Yeah, like, what, from believing in God? You know, you, of course you don't want to hinder others and make other people's lives miserable. That's just common sense. I mean, seriously, anybody with a fully functioning brain can is capable of that without a God. Lord, you have extended such grace to me. You have forgiven my wickedness and remembered my sins no more. Who said I was wicked? Only this book is claiming that. They claim like, oh, you're just wicked automatically. Probably because there's a million and one rules in the Bible. You can't even think about a woman and lust after her in your mind. That is complete nonsense. That That, that is the, the driving factor behind uh, why men get with women. I mean, is is because you're sexually attracted to women. That's not the only reason you like a woman. That's not the only reason you should marry a woman, but that's normally what stands out first is that she's attractive, or something about her attracts you, you know, maybe the way she smells, I don't know, but you can't just not lust after her, I mean, what is that, that's not love, that's not sexual attraction, that's just, um, I mean, might as well be a nun or a pope or something, well, I don't know about that, Lord, you have extended such grace to me, you forgive my weakness and remember my sins no more. Help me to express the same grace towards others. How are you going to help me, God? How, what, just, just, just read the Bible? Man, I might as well go to Beth Moore's house and ask her, because God's not telling me shit. 